Any news? Dr. Walker's running all the tests as we speak. He'll know if Jane's a candidate soon. Mm. Just wondering what kind of father I am lately. You're a marvelous father. You're going through a lot right now, Ethan. It's not fair. It's a miracle that Gwen was able to bring Jonathan into the world. Why, why would... Why would God want to take him right now so soon? No, he won't. Don't, don't think like that. And Jane, Jane's my little baby, too. Mm. Doctors say that if they take part of her liver, she might have health problems down the road. It's like a Greek tragedy or something. What if, what if I'm forced to sacrifice one child over the other? It's just in God. Leave it up to him. I'm trying. It's just this choice. I mean, on one hand, I want Jane to be a match for Jonathan so he can get better. But on the other hand, I don't, I don't want Jane to. Hell, I, I, I almost wish we were living 100 years ago when none of this medical magic was around so we wouldn't even have to make a decision. Does that sound terrible? No. No, just human. I wish Jonathan had an older sibling. Wish I had more children. Then it would make this decision a lot easier. Do the right thing. Let me tell Ethan the truth, and I will have little Ethan brought to the hospital immediately to be tested. Teresa, we're still waiting on Jane's test results. Why would I rock the boat when, when Jane could save Jonathan's life? Because you love her. Because she's young. Because this is wrong. Because the doctor said it would be better if we used someone older, someone like little Ethan. Just. Just stop it, because I know what you're trying to do. You're trying to guilt me into letting you tell Ethan that little Ethan is his son. So just stop, forget it, because it's not going to work. I'm not trying to guilt you, Gwen. I'm trying to save your child. But you would rather not tell Ethan the truth and let your own baby die. That is not what I'm saying at all. And don't you dare accuse me of that. Because Jane could be a match. And if all goes well, she will never even know that she had to give up part of her liver. And what if it doesn't work, Gwen? What if little Ethan is your son's only hope? Are you prepared to watch him die if Jane isn't a match? You think about that. I do think about that. That's the only thing I can think about. <laughs>